So, let's see what's maybe on the shortwave tonight. What do I do? First thing I hit is waveguide on my iPad, and it will show me right away um, what bands are open to Europe or elsewhere. So I see a lot of this yellow, and we have a, uh, that looks like 20 meters for that uh, yellow color. And we have a bit of green, a little bit of blue, some yellow, so some 30 meters, some 60 meters, but the main frequency over to Europe right now is 20 meters. And what about the other direction? Um, we got uh, Tokyo coming over on some of the brown color there. What is the brown color? It's 15 meters. So then I exit that app and I'm going to go into my SWBC SCED program from Black Cat. First thing you do is click the On Now button. So it's only going to be what's on now. And then we click on the 22 meter band to see what's up there. And uh, you will see, so here's some of the stations that we should be able to tune in. And uh, there's where they are, here's where they're beaming, and here's the, la the language, and here's the frequency, and the from two time slot. Uh, so, let's see what we get on the radio. Uh, let's go up to 13, start up. Thirteen eight five five. According to this, is I don't have anything on that, so maybe that's just uh, getting ready to come online or something. Let's go back down. I know I'm going really fast, but I'm just trying to not bore you with this video. I picked up a carrier here at 13715. Nothing on the uh, shortwave app for that. Sounds like a jamming signal. So, 13270 is most likely Gander Volmet in Canada. Since I am in Canada, that's most likely what that is on um, upper sideband.
Do you hear that hash every 10 seconds or so? I think that's an electric fence. I have this on almost all HF bands up here. And a lot of farms up here where I live. Well, it's most likely some kind of fencing. Oh, well, that's a quick look at the uh, 22 meter band. 19 meter band whatever it is quite bye for now